Hey everybody, it's Tony the Blacksmithing Gamer, and here we do everything from blacksmithing to 3D printing to bring the things inside the video games into the real world. This week, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3 is coming out. So with an opportunity to make some Wolverine Claws, of course I went and did it. So, let's get started. I'll show you how we made them. So, so today we're going to start off with the Wolverine Claws. Um, the initial idea I had was to put, use these wrenches and uh, make a San Mai technique around each one of them. But I've come to realize I'm not very good at San Mai. And uh, getting one to stick is uh, a lot easier than getting six. So I think uh, we might have to put this idea to the wayside, uh, save it for another project. But we're still going to make the blades. So stay tuned, we're going to get started. So we got our plastic version of the Wolverine blades. They're all the same uh, and they all go into a block like this. So this could probably be just replaced with a regular rod. So we've measured it out. This bar stock can do uh, six of these guys exactly. So this might be our perfect bar stock. still really rough but they're in the shape that I want them to be a little bit of grinding tweak the ends here a bit probably draw these ones out still but uh, we're on the way So, we got everything uh, shaped for the Wolverine Claws. It's now time for Quench. Wow. 
So now that we got the blades sharpened and well pretty much ready to go we are going to attach it to this guy. I marked out where I want the uh, blades to be mounted roughly so I'm going to take it over to the welder and let's weld it up. Thanks again for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button down there below. Or if you want to follow me on any of these social media websites, you can get daily updates on the projects I'm working on. Thanks again for watching. I'm Tony, the Blacksmith and Gamer, where every week we make things from the games we love. I'm going to show you some more